Well, hello, I'm Greg Uppum. I'm the stormwater coordinator for the town of Smyrna. And today is the third Saturday in June. And where else would we be but uh, Jefferson Springs Recreation Area for our 14th annual Boat Day. Well, Boat Day is an effort for uh, people to understand that they can't go out kayaking, canoeing, fishing, or swimming in the Stones River if they're not taking care of the Stones River. We have our uh, Bonnie Irvin with the Project WET program. That's a Rutherford County project that is funded by all five MS4 programs. Those are the stormwater programs in Rutherford County, including MTSU. So my name is Bonnie Irvin, and I am located in Rutherford County's Planning and Engineering Department, but I actually work for the stormwater managers in Laverne, Smyrna, MTSU, Murfreesboro, and Rutherford County. So they all pool their money so that I can do their education outreach. So I go into schools or into public events like this and my job is to teach about stormwater and water conservation, water quality, all the things that we need today that are critical. <laughs> we have an opportunity to correlate water quality and them, the attendees, with water recreation. We encourage all ages to come out. We've, I don't know who the oldest person is because I don't ask them that. At my age, I don't want to tell my age, 75, it's uh, time for me to do my bucket list. I've done canoes with my dad in a regular boat, but never a kayak, never. It's just what I want to do, you know, just something I've read about and thought about and I'm gonna do it. This is not gonna be dangerous. This is gonna be a bucket list mark off. Yeah, this was her, one of her items on her bucket list. She saw a sign on the side of the street telling me this about four days ago that this was going on. And we came with our little dog, Cindy, uh, named after Cindy Lauper, I think. I'm not really sure who she named her after. And my little dog really enjoys the people as well. She's kind of bashful, but she's getting better. We've had a lot of kids that come out with their parents on the, on the canoes. You walk down the hill here to the life jacket area, and those ladies are very well trained. We, we value your attendance, and we value your enjoyment in your life, and your understanding of the importance of keeping our streams clean. When I see people get out of the boats, they almost always have a big smile on their face. And oftentimes they'll comment, "We, this is the best event I've ever been to. This is so enjoyable. I think I'm gonna go out and buy a kayak or a canoe so my family and I can enjoy being out in the water together. 